Hello YouTube, this is your boy Cluster Gallery and I'm back again with another video. Today's video we are going to learn on how to add amazing skin tones to your image without wasting much of your time. Let's dive into it. Welcome back to this tutorial so to add skin tones to your image you'll first go to gradient map and look for legacy gradient uh, as you can see we are not seeing the legacy gradient here so i'll go to windows go to gradient so the gradient has appeared there so i'm scrolling through if i will see the legacy gradient so i'm not seeing it so i'll tap on the menu at the right corner and scroll through to look for legacy gradient and click on it so i scroll down again to see if it has appeared yeah and it's down there so i open the legacy gradient then scroll if i will see the photographic toning yeah it's there so i open the photographic toning so beside the gradient map we are going to use for our project so we have come back on our previous gradient map we went to open so you can choose from the right gradient or the left gradient anyone would work but i would rather choose the left gradient because it comes with the properties so i'll open it up a little bit so I'll just scroll through selecting the gradient one after the other for you to see the kind of gradient we have there. So this is what I'm going to use for this project but I'm still selecting for us to see how the rest of the gradients look like so we just selecting the gradients so when selecting the gradients to depend on you the kind of looks you need so at this point this is the kind of look i need so and for the gradient map you can you can use your own colors so as you can see i've just selected so you can choose to select any color from my color panel so this is how it works so i'll just set my blending mode to soft light and reduce my opacity all the way down to 20 yeah I think 20 is okay in any case want to know on how I retouched this portrait image can click on the link at the top right corner of this video or you can go back to our previous videos to watch the tutorial of this image retouching or then right click on the gradient map layer to set the blending mode so I'll move it from the darker part to the lighter part a bit then hold alt to split it and drag it back so 
I'll do the same thing to the down one. Drag it, split it, then drag it back. So I'll then press OK. So this is the before and after, before, after, before, after. So I want to apply the effects on only the model. So I just hold out, then click in between the gradient map and the next folder to clip it to that folder. So this is the end of this video. In case this video was really helpful, kindly like subscribe and press on the notification bell so that you don't miss out whenever we upload a new video see you in the next video bye